Well, a new fundraising initiative may help dozens of small businesses keep their doors open. That includes two restaurants here in central Indiana. CBS 4's Courtney Spinelli joins us with their emotional reaction. Thanks to a new fund launched by Barstool Sports, nearly $20 million has been raised to help businesses impacted by the pandemic. Here at the Rathskeller, after a particularly difficult year, they say today they can breathe a little sigh of relief. It was overwhelming. I'm emotional now, but you should have seen me last night. <laughs> When I learned about this, burdens of the pandemic weighing on small businesses across the U.S. It's been extremely tough here lately, and you know, um, quite frankly, we're just we're we're not making the bills. The Rathskeller and Special Dogs and more, just two Indiana businesses getting a helping hand from barstool sports and donors across the country. Its founder launching the Barstool Fund two weeks ago, now raising about $20 million in helping 100 small businesses. We've been close. It, it's just we, we don't give up. We try and find ways to adapt to what's going on around us. Special Dogs and More in Columbus helps train employees that are intellectually or mentally challenged. But sometimes even those doing great things need a helping hand. There's been a lot of tough, tough weeks and months through this pandemic. You know, and it's been an up and down roller coaster. Businesses apply to the fund, and if they're chosen, get a phone call to let them know. The emotions on display from many small businesses as they realize the weight about to lift off their shoulders. This money means everything in the world to us right now because we're able to, um, you know, um, keep the people um, employed. Dan McMichael has owned the Rathskeller since 1995. But he says 2020 was a year of challenges faced by the iconic Indianapolis spot. I'm just so pleased. I mean, it, it really changed um, my outlook for this year. This is about saving the mom and pop American businesses, which are the backbone of America. Both restaurants also express gratitude to all of the donors who made this possible. Barstool Sports tells us they hope to keep those monthly donations going for at least three months, if not longer, as long as those donations continue to come in. Reporting in Indianapolis, Courtney Spinelli, CBS 4 News. You can understand why they're so emotional. Absolutely. All right, Courtney, mm -hmm. thank you.